Hello, my name is Jason Geary, and I'm going to show you how to enable the SNMP monitoring service on Windows Vista and Windows 7 computers. Enabling SNMP on targeted devices is necessary if you want to receive SNMP information from those devices. This information includes monitoring CPU and memory usage and is critical if you're going to monitor a device using a network monitoring or network management solution. The first thing you will do is click on the Start menu and open the control panel. Depending on your control panel view, you will see different icons. Notice I have it view by large icons. Scroll down to Programs and Features, then click on Turn Windows Features On or Off. Once this box is populated, scroll down to the Simple Network Management Protocol, or SNMP box, expand it. Make sure that both the SNMP and the WMI SNMP provider boxes are checked and click OK. If this is not already checked, you'll have to wait a minute or two for Windows to enable the SNMP service. Now go back to your control panel and click on Administrative Tools. Then double click Computer Management, Services and Applications, Services, and then scroll down to the SNMP service. Don't confuse this with SNMP Trap. Double click on the SNMP service, go to the Security tab, and be sure that Accept SNMP Packets from Any Host is checked here. Then, for the routine public enablement of SNMP, under Accepted Community Names, you're going to click Add, make sure the community rights are read only, then type Public under Community Name, then click Add. You'll notice that I already have this here. Click OK, and then right-click on the SNMP service to be sure that it's started. This is how you enable the SNMP monitoring service on Windows Vista and Windows 7 computers.